today I just wanted to test my setup, make sure everything's going to record okay, because I'd like to, from now on, record some World of Warcraft and better quality. Today I'm not really going to do much, I'm just going to go over what I got on my screen. I got a whole bunch of mess, I know when I was on Twitch that's one thing people complained about, but it actually helps me out. Like, for instance, uh, down here in the corner, I use ELVUI because it helps me set up my buttons the way that my peripherals are. Because I have the Razer Naga, and if you notice the buttons on the side, I have it arranged to where it's easier to locate the buttons because it's not just the numbers, it's also formatted the same way and I also have this over here set up for my uh, orb weaver so I'm not using it right now because I needed an extra space or USB well I don't need more I can go ahead and plug it in also like the ELVU I set up because like I said it lets me customize my screen for what works best for me the only thing that I have to gripe about is that it's not on curse so it's not as easy to update unless you have the client for your desktop but that's not really a complaint because it's easy to download that client too and check it every so often just as easy as it is to get curse. I'm gonna go do a quest right quick for y'all so I'm not just doing nothing. But um yeah, this is my setup. Now I don't have any game noise. I should probably turn that on so I'm not too boring. Let's see. System. Sound. System default. There we go. It's a little bit loud though. bit of ambiance but we don't want to overpower my voice I don't know how loud it is right now this is a test video depending on it I'll turn it up or down when I was testing the mic earlier the audio level seemed to be pretty good there's something right here all right that's pretty cool now normally I main as a hunter, but for here I'm running as demon hunter because I've already maxed out my hunter on level. I'm trying to get my alts leveled now that I like to play. And I really like the new demon hunter because of mobility and I'm a person that likes to farm a lot. And when you're farming a lot, sometimes you need to uh, have that extra mobility. I'm also working on that golem mount. I know it's been since Pandaria, I should have one by now, but I haven't, but I'm working on it now. And I believe I'm completely missing where I'm supposed to go. No, it's around here somewhere. It's up on this rock, I think. Let's see. Another thing, like, you get used to the Demon Hunter, you zipping around all over the place with that spell, and I know it's supposed to be saved for, uh, fighting, but, 
it just makes it so much easier to travel. I was caught. Also, for the layout of my spells, I um, usually go in order of the importance of the spells according to the rotation. And for the rotation, I use either Noxic or Icy Veins because they generally have a good rotation to get the best DPS out of it. Now, that being said, I'm still not the best at following those rules. So, I tend to not get the best DPS. For the longest time, I relied on, uh, for the longest time, I relied on Spell Flash, but now that Spell Flash is basically falling to the wayside, I'm actually having to learn the game, and because of that, I, well, I know the basics for Hunters, I can still do decent amount of damage on my Hunter, but... Because the Demon Hunter is so fresh, I have to learn it from scratch. Gotta get them orbs because they heal you. I gotta be careful with that rush. I'm gonna kill these rabbits. some cool mini games on here too that you do while leveling I should have recorded it but there was one on my hunter where you were getting I believe it was Rexar which is one of my favorite characters in lore but you were getting Rexar and you had to do a little mini game where you had to run around and survive the night it was pretty cool something different so it's nice to know that not everything is going to be just your basic kill and collect. Of course I do that. Good job. Just kill the stuff. I don't quite remember this quest line. And I could have just forgotten it because when you're leveling, stuff that ain't that interesting kind of falls to the wayside. But there is some good points in this game. Uh, where it just I don't want to spoil it for anybody but there are parts where you learn things about the lore and cutscenes play and you're just if you know anything about the lore you go oh my god that's one thing I like about most games that I play is the lore Anything with deep lore. Ice Fang Pack Leaders. Am I going to? Oh, there we go. Trying to stop myself from sneezing. am I supposed to be doing? I'm supposed to be killing them by shooting rabbits at them, I guess. Oh, I remember this part. That's, that's actually pretty funny. Shooting it makes their little guys run away so you can just focus on the ice plant leader.
Well, I hope I haven't bored you today. Um, like I said, this is just a basic thing. I'm testing to see what direction I want to go in. If the quality is good, I'll keep with it. I want to do other things to better my videos and make them more interesting, but this is the first step to that direction. Thank everybody for watching. Please like and subscribe if you like this kind of content. I'd like to have any kind of insight I can get into making my content better for you. Alright, peace out everybody. Have a good night.